Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can create a product backlog on Trello. So let's get right into it. So a backlog is basically a list of features or a list of ideas that your product has or that you wish to implement into it. It is basically mostly used in the Agile method and you can very easily use Trello to do that. However, I would recommend you use Jira since that is made exclusively pretty much for the Agile method. It is uh, designed around it pretty much, but you can use Trello just as well. Now, what you want to do is the divide the product into epics which are very uh, well main functionalities uh, which have a lot of sub functionalities or sub goals that you need to meet for example for web dev we'll add a sign in page and a log in page and then we'll have for example sign in i don't know uh enter username and password we'll add a captcha we'll add an email field and we're gonna, I don't know, add some documents, for example, a uh, valid ID. For example, these are the fields that you need to use for signing in. Then once you've created those cards in these lists, you can go into each of these cards. You can set a deadline by going into dates and setting a due date if you want to. However, you can just keep it empty if you want, and then you can add a description for each card well individually and then once you do that you basically have a backlog and then you're going to want to create several lists of the well entire backlog of all the functionalities of your product or at least of your uh, work on that product of your role uh, and yeah that is basically all there is to it it is as easy as that again i would recommend that you use jira instead of trello since jira is made for this you can use that or asana or any other sort of application or service however that's pretty much it hope you guys enjoyed and i'll be seeing you guys in another video